Hello guys, in this video we will be learning about fitting of a straight line. So the normal equation for this is y is equal to a plus bx. So this is the equation for straight line. But we have to find this a and b. So the formula to find out a uh, straight line is normal formula or the equation you can say summation y is equal to n a plus b summation x summation x y is equal to a summation x plus b summation x square so this is the formula to find out for a straight line so you also have a for a second line on that second line is also called as parabola so in this video we will be solving how to find a straight line so this is the question which we are provided with so let's find out so looking in the formula first is what summation y so we can get summation y by adding this so after adding i get 24 now n n is nothing but the total number you have in this column so n is equal to 6 so we have 6 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 now we have a we have to find out b we should find out and summation x summation x is nothing but total of this value so after totaling up i get again 24 now what it is summation x y so let's find out for x and y so you have to multiply this so if i multiply i get 2.4 6 10.8 16 30 and 48 so let's find out the summation for this so after totaling i get 113.2 and next we get this value directly a we need to find out then we need x square so let's square it up after squaring i get all these values let's find out its summation so after adding all this i get 130 so now let's apply in the formula and solve the problem so i'll take the first equation that is summation x equal to n a plus b summation x so let's give the values so summation y summation y 24 is equal to 6 a plus b x values again 24 so this is 24 equal to 6 a plus 24 b so this is my first equation now second equation let's apply the values so it's 113.2 equal to summation x that is 24a plus 130b. So this is my second equation. Now let's solve this. So I'll take the first one 24 equal to 6a plus 24b. 113.2 is equal to 24a plus 130b. So now what we have to do is let's find out for A. Now A is equal to, now this is your A, this is the B and this is the equal symbol. So when you find A, you just after covering A, you have to take this values and then this value. So 24, then 24, then 113.2, then 130 divided by A and B. So that is 624, 24, 130. 624, 24, 130. We have to cross multiply this so when i cross multiply this i get 3120 minus cross multiply this this value divided by this cross multiplication so here it is 780 minus 576 so now this is equal to 403.2 divided by 204 so after dividing i get 1.97 so now we have to find for b so let's find it here only so the denominator for b will also be the same so 6 24 and 24 130 so here if it is b so just cover this up and then find out with this so it's 26 24 24 1 13.2 so this is equal to 6 7 9 2 minus 576 divided by the same this value because the denominator is same so i get 103.2 divided by 204 so here it is 0 
5. Now here I got my a value and my b value. So let's substitute in that equation where y is equal to a plus bx. So here you can say that y is equal to a. A value is 1.97 which is approximate to 2. So 2 plus b. B value is nothing but 0 0.5. So, 0 0.5. And if you see here in the equation, you have your x. So, just write it down. So, this is how you find out for a straight line. So, thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, like and share.